Subject D-9341. Whoa. Enter the containment chamber or you will be terminated. No. I won't. This is your you can't make me. Oh, is it? No, I think you have five seconds to comply. Listen, let me speak to your manager. Le is your manager around here? What? Yeah. No, I'm fine. I'm your determination. I got shot. A bullet hit my left shoulder. I'm fine, though. I'm okay. Oh, I died. Hello and welcome to Mr. Red Plays SCP Containment Breach. Uh, I'm playing this game. This is a scary game. Fair warning. Uh, and I've been getting really into the SCP Foundation lately. I've always kind of been into it, but I've been getting more into it just lately. Uh, and so I wanted to play this game. And really, I don't need to explain why I'm playing a game to you, because I can just play whatever I want. It's my show, my channel. Uh, but this game we're playing, so I'm excited about it. I actually think that I played this before. Let's play the most dangerous game. Uh, and uh, I, I think I played this before a long time ago, but I don't remember. So we'll find out. Uh, it's probably been really updated and everything because I feel like people are talking about it like it's new. So I'm excited. You're excited. I can tell. Let's get into it. Okay, I am in a room. Oh, it's very portal. I'm waking up, it's Portal. Hello, greetings. Let's pick up the paper on the desk. We did it, let's press tab to open the inventory. Let's double click on the document to view it. I'm about to blink, hold on, there we go. Uh, orientation leaflet for the class D personnel. Hmm. Uh, on behalf of the SCP Foundation. Control, this is Agent Algren. I need a request to open up cell 311. 311? What cell is that? Is that my cell? It is. Hold on. Let's put this away. Uh, okay, hold on. Before we do that, I'm going to go ahead and uh, change the uh, uh, mouse sensitivity because it's wow. Oh, that's better. There's like a weird like slowness to it. Hey, that's rude. I was reading something. We're authorized to uh, exterminate any disobedient test subjects, so I'd recommend not doing anything stupid. I, I recommend you shut up. That's what I recommend. I was trying to read that document. That was rude. Please, Doctor Valveson, call on line one. Doctor Valveson. Doctor Vaseline. I don't really watch movies. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. You don't really watch movies. That's not weird. Oh yeah, great. Somebody should do that. Let me go in first. Let me go on ahead. You guys catch up. I'm going on ahead. Yeah, so I don't know what to uh, what to expect from this. I don't know what the what I don't know what's gonna happen in this game. I'm scared. I know you can blink. You have a stamina meter. Which I'm gonna run out of stamina. Hold on. All right, I'm out of stamina. It's the SCP Foundation. It's fun. You know it. You love it. Boy, they are taking their sweet ass time, aren't they? Let's press this button. Door appears to be locked. Well, we tried. Oh, here we go. It's SCP-173. Object pad, blah, 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 blah. Sentient and violent. Both. Oh, what's this? Oh, cool. Kid was taking papers to his supervisor. Yeah. Sucks. Then what happened? Was that the end of that story? It shook up Dr. L pretty badly. He hasn't left his office. Oh. He says he's been hearing things. Where's his office? What's he hearing? Let's go talk to him. See what he has to say for himself. Uh, are we waiting on somebody? What's going on here? Can we go in? Let's go in. Let's enter. And do it. Go. This way? No. Bro. Bro. Wow, I hate these controls. You pushed the button, but nothing happened. Well, that sucks. Hey, I pushed the button, but nothing happened. Hey, you want a kiss? <laughs> you want to make out a little bit? Is he scared of me? What's going on? Is he just following me around, maybe? And I can go wherever I want? That sounds cool. Door appears to be locked. Where'd he go? Oh, he's right here. All right. Whoa. And hey, what about you? you? Just walking into that wall there? You seem cool. Can I go through here? Nope. Yeah, all right. Why, why don't you lead the way? Why, why don't you tell me where I'm going? All right, the gang's all here. Yeah, we've been wasting so much time. Yeah? By the way, what? By the way, pause. Oh, there's no, uh, 
There's no subtitles, so I have no idea what the- Oh! Oh! <laughs> Jesus! What was that now? Our SCP-173 is to be kept in a locked container at all times. When personnel must enter SCP-173's container, no fewer than three may enter at a time, and the doors to remain to be locked behind them. At all times, two persons must maintain direct eye contact with SCP-173 until all personnel are vacated and reopen the uh, relocked container. This is the one where you have to stare at him. If you blink, which is why there's a blinking mechanic, um, he you die. That's it. Hmm. Curtains for you. Go, please! I'm tired of this not going nonsense. Tell him to go. Tell your friend to go. Tell him to go. Can we go? The object cannot move well within a direct line of sight. Line of sight must not be broken at any time with SCP-173. Fine. What about the other one? Never got to read this. Uh, on behalf of SCP Foundation and our staff, we welcome you to an exciting one-month working period in one of our top secret research facilities. Unfortunately, the exact details of your upcoming work assignments are highly classified, but please read this document carefully to make your stay as safe and pleasant as possible. Each of the Class D personnel has been given a numerical designation. Your personal designation is D9341. Please memorize your designation as the staff will use it to refer to you from now on. During your stay, you will be taking part in various testing procedures. Some of them can be extremely dangerous if appropriate precautions are not met. This is why you need your full cooperation. At all times and all circumstances, our highly trained researchers and scientists know how to minimize risks and ensure the safety of the personnel involved in testing. If you fail to comply with the instructions you are giving, given, you will be sent to your term in death row. Cool. If everything goes as planned, meaning that we have your full cooperation, you will be released at the end of the month and you will be granted an absolute pardon for all your previous offenses. Huh. Alright, so this seems to kind of imply that I'm a little bit of a criminal. Just a little bit. And I did some badness. Some badness, Everdeen. Damn it. Uh, and that's fine. That's, that's fine. We couldn't have done bad. I guess now we're, if this is a punishment? Well, that makes sense. Who would deliberately want to be a Class D personnel, you know what I mean? Um, now what? Are you waiting on me? What's going on now? Is this, is it, ah. Oh. oh, God. I turned around too fast and uh, this, this guy scared me. Yeah, I'd love for anything to happen. I got achievements. Encountered the zombie plague. That sounds bad. But doctor, doctor, I found the cure. That's good. Well, this all seems cool, but you gotta play the game first. Is that why I have the object difficulty on Keter? Is it, is it because, is that why this is happening? <laughs> I shouldn't be doing this. This is, this is inappropriate. I really don't think I can do anything here. Let's look at the controls. Maybe I have to do something. Uh, forward, back, left, right. Manual blink space. Sprint is left shift. Inventory crouch quick save. And then the co the console. Open a close console. Why, that does just about nothing. And by the way, what? <laughs> Didn't you say, and by the way? I think that's it. I think that's it right there. I'm gonna restart. Just name myself Mr. Red this time to make it real different. Ah, good. You're finally awake. <laughs> that was that was GLaDOS from Portal doing uh, Skyrim. That's fun. I'm just gonna throw up real quick. <laughs> Bust out of this joint. Can I go back to sleep? Let me out! We're authorized to kill any disobedient test subjects, so don't try anything stupid. We'll kill that guy. He's disobedient. He's literally not listening to any order you give him. I'm gonna try something stupid real quick. Attention. Alright, it's locked. I'm gonna go this way. Yeah. I'm not gonna go this way. Oh, look, that guy, he's, uh, he's, he's on his computer. Wait, wait, well, look, let's look and see what this guy's doing. Are you working hard or hardly working? He's all right. Well, we're here. Yeah. I'm still disappointed I didn't get to punch you in the face. But, yeah. Uh, you were locked our friend out. The way. All right, I'll take this. Okay. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second, now he's not here. All right, he's gone. Now he's gone, so I can go through. Oh, here we go. All right, so this is it. This is him. Oh, there he is. 
Press space to blink. Ooh, that was risky. Alright, I don't want to. I'm not gonna. That seems like a bad time. I'm not gonna. I'm staying out here where it's safe. Whoa. No. I won't. You can't make me. Oh, is it? No, I think you have five seconds to comply. Listen, let me speak to your manager. Is your manager around here? What? Yeah. No, I'm fine. I'm your determination. I got shot. A bullet hit my left shoulder. I'm fine, though. I'm okay. Oh, I died. Well, that was <laughs> a travesty. Let's name myself Mr. Red 2 and try that again. Whoa. What is this? SCP-939, endothermic. Uh, the primary method of luring prey is imitation of human speech and the voices of prior victims. Scary. All right, we, we'll try this again. This time, we will comply. Listen, I'm a rebel. I'm a rule breaker. You can't hold me down. I don't listen to no rules. I don't listen to nobody. I play by the beat. My, I'm a drummer that play that I play. I'm, I'm good at playing the drums. Is there a knock button? Can I knock on the door? Press the knock button. Hey, it worked. All right, see ya. No, I'm out. I'll take it from here, you guys. Yeah, hell? you just wait here. Hey, what? Stop. No. Ah! No, I got shot again. I was going to where I was supposed to go. Boy, I would not be a good prisoner. All right, Mr. Red 3, let's do this. I was created after placing a pill of SCP-500 in the input booth of SCP-914 and using the fine setting. It displays no unusual activity when closed. That's interesting. I always like the SCPs that are like combinations of SCPs. You know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? Another day, another migraine. Now this says, if you fail to comply with the instructions you are given, you will be sent back to your term in death row. Now, the last two times that I did not comply with directions, I was not sent back to my term in death row. I was killed. So... We're authorized to exterminate. Yeah, I know. I've been there before. Old news, dude. <laughs> Old news. So these guys really don't give you a, a second chance, do they? They're just like, nope, you're donezo. Hey, when you shot me before, listen, can we talk? When you shot me before, I felt like that was very rude and that you did not respect me as a person. And I, okay, sorry. He, he doesn't want to talk. You, you're, you, sometimes you need words of affirmation. Uh, you need to talk to somebody, guy. All right, he'll be ready later. Sometimes you just got to give people time. Sometimes people just aren't ready to open up, you know? You just gotta, you can't push them. You stay the hell out here because if you get trapped in there with me, we're not going anywhere and I can't have that again. So I'm gonna, whoa, I didn't, I didn't do that. I did not do that. All right, you stay out, get out of here. Let, let me have it. Awesome, it's just what I wanted, thanks. All right, let's blink a lot. Whoa, ah, that sucked. All right, I'll go next. Oh god, I hate this. All right, let's coordinate our blinks. All right, on three, I'll blink. One, two, three, blink. This is scary. Uh, there seems to be a problem with the door control system. What? The door isn't responding to any of our attempts to close it. Why? Okay, done. Don't blink. God in heaven. God in heaven. All right, I'll see you later. Oh. Oh. Uh, it's up there. Oh, it was up there though. Oh, it was up there though. Uh oh, I don't know where it is. I'm getting out of here. This place is done for. Heep, heep. Oh God. Oh, it's locked. Good, it's locked. Oh, I can go down here now though. Oh God, my my mouse. The mouse though. All right, I, I hold shift to run, but it's 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 I'm out of stamina. Out of stamina. Alright, bad things are happening, you guys. This is awful. Alright, where to go? Where to go now? Oh, hi! Oh, hi! Are you okay? Here, come with me. I'll take your body! I may have died just then. 
Oh no, I died. Subject D9341 killed by the Tesla gate at Redacted. Uh, whoops. Well, let's load game. No saved games! Mr. Red. Four. If everything goes as planned, you will be released at the end of the month, and you will be granted an absolute pardon for all your previous offenses. <laughs> I like to imagine the Emperor created the SCP Foundation. That's what SCP stands for. Emperor Palpatine. Don't try anything stupid. Now, define stupid. Attention. Is this stupid? Is this stupid? Is this what you would define as stupid? What do you think? You think this is pretty stupid? All right. You know, you'd think that if this were like the, the, the top secret security place that has all of the horrors of the world in it, they'd have a little bit better security. You know what I mean? Like they would fix these doors. So that stuff like this doesn't happen. I'm going in. Hey there, best friend. You're my best friend! I'm gonna blink. Oh god, that was really scary. I think maybe this thing won't kill you right now. I'm not gonna test that theory out, because that sounds bad. Uh-oh. Oh, he killed that guy. Oh, he killed that guy. Oh, he's looking at me. He's friendly. Hi, friendly guy. Wait, what? What? What happened? Did I die? Fatal cervical fracture. According to Security Chief Franklin, who was present in SCP-173's containment chamber during the breach, the subject was killed by SCP-173 as soon as the disruptions in the electrical network started. No! That didn't happen. Security Chief Franklin's a liar. He's a liar because I was looking at him. Mr. Red 5, let's go. Although, is this not... Really, Mr. Red 6, if you think about it, because I did the first one as Link. But that was just a restart, so that one didn't really count. This is actually Mr. Because Mr. Red was the actual play. Mr. Red plays. God, I get it. I get it. I, I get it. But, like, do we need to do this? Oh, wait, you can skip intro. All right, next time we die, <laughs> not that we're going to, but if, if by some chance we do, uh, we'll turn that off. We'll turn off the, the intro. They should make a SCP game about the uh, SCP-001 scenarios like i was just reading about those i like the, i like the when day breaks one that one's cool you got a friend in me you got a friend in me thanks give me thanks you got troubles i got them too and you're miles and you're miles from your nice warm poo you just remember about the SCP. Yeah, you got a friend in me. Please approach SCP-173 for testing. Why? We can see him from here. Do we have to get close to him? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Do I move or do I not move? Do I not move or do I... Right, let's do a new game. Let's uh, enable outro. Let's not do that. Mr. Red 6. All right. We're in it now. We're in it, baby. In it to win it. That's what I say. All right. So here we are. We're doing this. We're actually really doing this. And in the next episode, we'll be really doing it. Guys, thanks for watching. Tune in in uh, two days for more exciting SCP ventures. Uh, I've been Mr. Red. Until then, stay spooky out there, everybody. And remember, keep watching. <laughs>